everyone, this is the Bearded Zeno, and we have another 1-6 scale figure unboxing, again, from Hot Toys, and it's another Star Wars. Hey, so we have, it's the uh, holiday word at this time, a 1-6 figure SW7KR. It's Kylo Ren. Yes. Seems like everybody and their mother has gotten this figure way before I did, and this was my birthday present and my birthday was last week <laughs> so basically got this thing uh, it's a week after my birthday pretty much so lovely <laughs> but hey I'm not gonna complain because it's freaking Kylo Ren one of my favorite new characters uh, in, in the Star Wars franchise I, mean, I love Rafe she's my favorite character of all time now in Star Wars just above uh well no sorry Favorite human character. Chewbacca's number one. But she beats Obi-Wan for me now, which is just fantastic. So I can't wait to get her figure because you know I'm going to. Actually, I, I'm going to get two. <laughs> I'm going to buy two. Uh, one with the BB-8 set and one just like the normal one. I'm going to have just the scavenger look on her. So be on the lookout for those. I'm buying two of the same Hot Toys figure. That's crazy. Uh, here's the front of the box. For, you've seen this everywhere by now. It's just the standard Hot Toys box. Okay, uh, here is the inside flap. Oh my damn. <laughs> oh my damn. That is beautiful. And that's of the figure, too. And that's of the, uh, the Hot Toy Stormtroopers. Wow. I'm still absolutely in love with the, the Hot Toy Stormtroopers. They're, they're just fantastic in Episode 7 Stormtroopers. So, oh. Oh, oh, oh. He's so beautiful. Why am I singing hello? Let's get this out of here. This figure is amazing. Oh, wow. This, look at the smell. This doesn't smell like a normal Hot Toys figure. It's strange. We got a sideshow figure the other day that smelled like a Hot Toys figure, and this one smells like something new entirely. Okay. Pop the seal. The cloak was stuck on the plastic there. Oh. You can smell the dye in the clothes. So let's take this out real quick. That's his saber. Set that to the side. There's the little thing that holds it in the head. Stand is below him. I'm just gonna take that out. Put him back in the stand for the packaging real quick. Let's go ahead and open this. Stand a magoo. What's all those, are those cracks supposed to be there? What the? You see all those cracks in there? They're not in the plastic. Is that supposed to be there? I think it's the paint up under there, the paint. Uh, I kind of like it, actually. Uh, that's kind of weird. Uh, let me know if your base is like that for your Kylo Ren. I haven't seen that in any other reviews. So, uh, I might actually finally uh, get fed up with Sideshow and get a different uh, replacement figure. So, yeah, that's... Uh, what the fuck is this crotch? There we go. <laughs> Got a bag over his head. That's great. Ugh. All right, take that off. So, let's take these off. Can I get without getting a hand off? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Ah, oh, two in a row? Are you kidding me? That is amazing. I can't believe I did that. Normally I just have to cut the suckers off. Oh, beautiful. This guy is very light on accessories, though. Every single Jedi or Sith seems to be light on accessories. Let's go ahead and put this cloak back over his head. Throw up. Ooh, come on. Can we 
get the boots off? With the boots. And dust boot, can we get dust boot off please? I did one, finally! <laughs> Maybe Hot Toys is finally learning their lesson here. Oh, this is great! Nope. Nope, that ain't gonna come off. Oh, oh yeah! I'm feeling good about myself because I did an arbitrary task. His uh, cloak is sticking together. Okay. I think I was supposed to do that, but whatever. Didn't leave any marks. Again, it's just the, I think it's just the die. Alright, let's put him back on. Is it stunned? Ooh. Alright. Now let's look at his accessories officially now. I'm gonna tear it's not a whole heck of a lot. Actually. Instruction manual. They've made these instruction manual plastics kind of way cheaper plastic now. And I do not appreciate that, Hot Toys. Alright. I suggested to uh, shape the hood in the style as pictured above. Okay, basically say, hey, use the wire to make it look right, otherwise it's gonna look stupid and poofy. <laughs> okay, that's how you insert the batteries. Yada yada. Say so swap out the arm. Yeah, we all know how to do that if we have a Jedi figure before. Uh, parts are not detachable. Do not try to take off otherwise. Outfit may get damaged. I wasn't planning on uh, making him in kind of sexy poses anyways. Uh, I don't uh, do that kind of shit with my figures, so... Uh, apologize if you were helping to sneak kind of pictures like that. Nope, I don't I don't address my figures. That is just... That is wrong. I mean, if you're going to take a down look at like the, the, uh, the, uh, the make of it like uh, uh, Clipper King does... That's fine, but I'm not going to undress this figure. I'm not. I'm not going to do that. No, I have no purpose of doing that. Here we go. We got some feet. Oh man, those look nice. They feel a bit rubbery, which I actually prefer. That way it doesn't snap any hand pegs. Now watch the first one of these. I'm going to swap. I'm going to end up snapping a hand peg. That's the nice end. <laughs> I was gonna say the force push hand, but then I actually just it force pushed itself out of my hand. That's great. So that's all the hands that you get. Now the clamshell is empty. We got a lightsaber and an arm. <laughs> wow. So I can see why a lot of people were a little disappointed with this release. That they, they said they were gonna pass because it just didn't come with too heck of a lot. And he could have came with an unmasked head sculpt, but honestly, I would prefer this head sculpt that he has over the unmasked anyways. So I would rather him just have this head sculpt. Because if they added a second head sculpt, he would have been an extra $20 or so, probably. So, we'll probably just have like a, um, a, uh, Toy Fair exclusive unmasked coloring. Ooh, all the white shit on there. You see that? It's like with Pops, how they get like the, the factory marks. Ugh. 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 I want to clean that off. So, yeah, I guess I'll uh, stick some batteries in this guy, get him posed up, take some pictures, review him. Uh, maybe next week. Uh, maybe even this week. I got a lot of shit to review. So, yeah. Uh, but. First impressions, this guy is really nice. Well, I haven't done this in a while, so let's go ahead and do an articulation test. Oh, wow, that's not... It's <laughs> not hindered at all. You can facepalm. Whoa, why? <laughs> oh, man, if he had an uh, arrow quiver, he could get some arrows over there. That's awesome. He also pat himself on the back. Okay, I'm not getting too much range out of there. <laughs> that's, that's just the way it naturally folded. That's great. And yeah, it's, it's just a standard two top under here. There's nothing, nothing complicated at all. Only hindrance you're gonna have is gonna be in the chest. You can't 
get anything crazy out of the chest because there's so many layers and shit in there. So, good enough for me. That's all I'm really going to use for. Oh, that's great. I know you're just looking at me staring intently at the figure, so... There you go. I'm not too happy with this base though, how it's all crackled like that. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that. Somebody please tell me in the comments down below if it's supposed to have that crackled look. Because if it's not, I'm finally gonna get fed up in context I show. Because that is ridiculous. I... I don't like that. I mean... If that's the way it's supposed to look, then badass, but... I think it's supposed to be solid, and that just, that looks bad. For what, a $230 figure? Nah, I don't know. Nope. I'm not keeping that if that's what it is. So yeah. Anyways, I'll see you in the next video. Uh, no idea what that will be. Um, if you have questions or concerns, leave in the comments down below. Uh, let me know what you uh, think about this figure. Again, let me know if you have this figure and if you have a crackled base like that. I gotta, I gotta cut that. And I'll see you in the next video.